All right, so here we are, ready for round one We're in our wicked ass golf cart here. I love, absolutely love the style of this. Look, look at this guy. We have the old uh, like Paper Mario vibes. We can just flip around. Let's go. Let's do it. Head in the hole one here. Start our journey up through golf purgatory. What are we dealing with here on hole one? So these courses are quite long. I imagine they're going to get longer and longer as the game progresses as well. And they're quite elaborate. Got to get through all of this stuff here. We have a limited amount of moves as well, effectively. We only have five to begin with. All right, so let's, uh, we can do a quick zoom out. We can quickly see what we're dealing with. I think we'll just smash it over. And then we smash it upwards. Oh, actually, I think that might do that itself. We can uh, get close enough. All right, let's just drive it as long as far as we can. See what happens. Oh, all right, we made it into the uh, air vent, which then shoots us all the way over to the other side. Nice. So there's gold and silver statues throughout the course. The gold ones will give you plus four shots, and I believe the silver ones will give plus two shots as well. This game does have the roguelike elements as well, and these come in the form of ace cards, they're called. So we have them down here in the bottom right, where we can do some different things, like there's, we have this one to add one shot to our current park count. We can rewind, return to a previous shot. There's all sorts of different ones that we will unlock throughout the game as well, which will be, which can definitely come in handy. Um, so I think we just smash it over, yeah. Another, just, another big one, as far as we can, nice, yeah, so the silver ones do give two shots, good to know. Alrighty, maybe a little shot up here, I still got the, no, I still have the driver out, that actually might be okay. Ooh. Ooh, yeah, I think that will just make it over there. Oh, we missed the silver one though. Uh, the, the hole's right here. Oh. Do we have something to blow this TNT up with, TNT up with though? Now there should be an ace card, whether we have it or not. It doesn't look like it. I wonder if I can uh, hit the golf ball into this TNT and make it explode. Let's find out. Yep. <laughs> we sure can. Alright, well that'll, that'll do it. Alright, so we're in the rough. But that's fine. Now if we just smash it down here to the hole. Uh, that might bounce in. Maybe? 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 <laughs> Maybe not. Ripped off. Alright, well we have, um, we've got five shots to get into this hole. Easy. I've actually got six shots. It's really hard to tell how much power you need. Like, I feel like just a baby amount. Yeah, like that. Perfect. Golf clap! So that's the first hole out of 18. That one was actually that one was actually pretty good. Not bad at all. Let's move on to the next hole. You know, uh, sweet as little buggy again. As we go through all the crowds here. In the hole number two. See what we're dealing with here. We're gonna go across. Got some statues, got some air vents going on. Got a whole bunch of TNT. Nice, nice. Alright, well, to begin with, we'll just smash it to the right hand side again. Uh, I'm not sure how high I wanna go. We'll just go as high as we can. We'll just hope for the best. Oh, easy. Oh, well, it might be just like a little bit too close though to be able to hit this gold statue. It's not a great angle. Um, I'm going, we can switch between a wedge and iron and a driver. I'm gonna want. Maybe I'll grab the iron here. I feel like this angle is not good. I wanted to hit this uh, statue actually. This is. Yeah, okay. We need to go back a little bit. That's really bad. <laughs> That's. That was a really bad angle to be on. We hit it a little bit too far.
get our iron back out. Iron. I think we should be able to just smash it now. And go straight through. Oh, crap. I misclicked. Misclick. Rip. <laughs> Rip. Um, I'm not sure if we can uh, salvage that. Actually, we have uh, we have cards. Hold on. Let's use our mulligan. Let's rewind that. So that gives us our... Uh, that gives us one of our pars back. Alright, there we go. That's better. Plus four shots for that. A little bit too close again, though. Let's go high. I think we might actually need the wedge for this one. Yeah, okay. Um, try and get as much distance as we can. Okay. Now, I don't think I have anything to blow this TNT up. We didn't last time. I assume we still don't. Take a practice shot. Oh, it was your turn. Change the direction of the ball mid flight. Oh, nice. Ball is destroyed upon the end of the shot. I mean, I guess we just hit it into the TNT. Um, maybe even a wedge here? I assume that'll bounce me. Okay. Well, that works. That works out just fine. Alright. We want the driver for this one. I'm just going to slog it best. Straight down the middle there. Oh no! Into the bunker! Rip! Well, that's what I get. Oh, we have to use the wedge here, of course. Thought we might be able to use an iron, but... Okay, well that works out fine anyway. Up we go, across we go, get a plus two shots. Now how do we get this one down... Yeah. Um, I have... Oh, we could use the one that changes the ball direction mid-flight, maybe? We can just go for the hole. We have four shots, so I think I'm just going to go for the hole here. I think if we hit it as far as we can, I think it should be okay. We'll go about iron. See how that plays out. Oh. Almost, almost we got it in, it's not too far off. Now we just want to part it in, just a little party putt putt. And bam, that's hole two number down, done and dusted, just like that. That's not too bad. Got a little bit of more, a little bit of extra money. All right, let's head on up to the next hole, hole number three, and then we get to go to the shop afterwards as well. This is a really cool game. I actually love the style of it, and the gameplay is like simple yet fun, and has like a lot of puzzle elements to it. It's a really cool concept. dealing with here. Got all sorts of stuff going on in this one. Got a lot of water by the look of it and um, teleport machines. Alright, well I guess we just hit it straight in here. That will uh, teleport our ball far and wide wherever it may take us. Alrighty, what do we do here? Yeah, do we like hit it up at the uh, TNT maybe? I feel like I want the wedge for this angle. This is an awful, awful angle. Oh, I was hitting it the wrong direction as well. Um, how does the iron work here? Let's see. It doesn't look like the iron will have the reach. No, so we need to use the uh, wedge. I don't think I can hit the TNT though. Maybe. Maybe. Nope, not quite. But I assume that's fine. I mean, we wouldn't have been able to go up there anyway. Alright, and we'll just drive it down here, not with a wedge though. Maybe an iron for this one. Yeah, that'll 
looks good. Oh. Uh, oh, it looks like we can go different ways though. Uh, no. Let's have a look. Super quick. Um, so we can go down this way. There's TNT, all sorts of things. Oh, there's like all sorts of ways to go here. Wait, there's two flags? There's a flag up here. Weird. So we have this teleport machine. I have no idea where it goes though. If we go over here, which will shoot us up, across, up, across. I think we might go left. Because left has a couple gold um, statues as well. We need a lift with the fan. Take us across a little bit. I think we might have enough shots to get it there. Have to max hit up here with the wedge. And then we're stuck in the rough, unfortunately. But we still have two shots. We'll hit it down here as far as we can. Oh, I was just, just too slow. I could have actually got it just over here if I was um, if I clicked fast enough. All right, so we have one shot left, but we can get this um, gold statue, I think. Oh, maybe not. Oh, this is a tricky situation, actually. Um, all right, so we can add plus one shot at least. Um, I think we might. What can we do with the driver? Can that maybe just get through? Mm, not really. Maybe I have to use the wedge here. Ooh, yeah, the wedge I think just gets there. Maybe it'll bounce and hit. Nice. Alright, so that's plus four shots at least. We need to just do a little bounce with our wedge again off this top roof. Um, I think that angle works. <laughs> Only just. Alright, and then we just go left here, I think, and then we should almost be at the hole. This one's not too bad. Yeah. Alright, I think we use our iron for this bit. Yeah. Oh, phew. So I've got to be careful with that angle. Go in, maybe? Maybe? There was like lots of different paths you could take in this one though, it seemed. I just need to do a little tap. A little tappy tap. Here we go. Donk! Oh, survived! Number three down. Perfect. Two par remaining. I think that gives us some extra money. All right, let's head on over to the shop. See what the uh, Scotsman has here at Eternity. So I believe this is where, yeah, where, this is where we can buy cards. What sort of cards are you selling here, mate? Oh, they're packs. Oh, we can buy two particular ones. Grab the mulligan and let's grab a gold booster pack. See what we get. So it looks like we get five different ones. Okay. Transform, transform the ball into a mini rocket. Fly slow but excellent at cornering. Nice. Very not bad. I'm not sure what the card, what the card binder does. We always have outfits too. The Cursed, the Scotsman, the Berserk Boy, the Key Lime, the Director, the Plumber. Uh, we've obviously got to be the Plumber, right? Wait, did that even change? It did, but it's not. I swear it was redder than that. Now it's like orange. All right. Hey, wait, has lessons for us? Sub Scotsman. Want to hear a joke, wee one? Knock knock. Who's there, Scotsman? Wish list. Ha ha ha! A wish list cursed to golf, that's who. 
Man, what a joke. Ha ha ha. So funny. We have, um, oh, the game has uh, global scores as well. Nice. Nice. I think there, maybe there's only five. Wait, it's the driving range? I don't want the driving range. I think there may be only five holes in the demo here. Alright, well, let's continue on then. What have we got up this way? Select a path. We go left or right? So left looks like a hard level, maybe? Looks like money, a card, and then a hard level. And then the boss level. YOLO. I'm not scared of no harder level. Plus, I'm also curious as to what it is. Prize chest, plus 215. Does not seem great. And let's see what sort of card we get here from our pack. Lead weight. Turn your ball into lead, no bounce upon landing. Okay, that can come in handy. Alright, let's see what we're dealing with here. Hole number four, and it's cursed. Alright, so what makes this one harder than like the others? Is it just because like has a lot going on perhaps? Alright, well, can you survive? Possibly not. Alright, so we just smash it left, hope for the best. Cool. Alright, well, oh, next curse, Bouncy. Alright, so it looks like we get uh, curses as we play on this one. Yeah, right. Alright, that was good. That went the way we needed it to. Made it to the fairway. I mean, I don't see... I think Bouncy could be, like, a help, though, right? Alright, so... Pretty cosy in here. Maybe the driver would still work okay, though? Hmm. I'd like to go just a smidge lower. Maybe the iron. Oh, but then I'm gonna end up in the water, aren't I? That's a heart, actually. Alright, let's see... Ten seconds to your bird birdie eye timer. Time stop mid flight. All right, let's time stop mid flight. Um, what I'm planning on doing is stopping here. Oh no, I missed. I screwed it up. <laughs> I didn't click fast enough. Ended up in the water anyway. Ah, uh, bugger. Alright, so we now, the next two shots, we're now bouncy. So, actually, can I use my driver? I can use the driver here, can't I? I think we can. I feel like bouncy is not such a bad thing. Uh, where do we go? I want to get that silver one, I guess. We try and hit it over here and get the silver statue. Now we have to use the wedge. Oh, we might not even have the distance. No. Alright, well let's try and bounce into this TNT maybe? No. Okay. <laughs> you can stop now, ball. Like, it's fine. Alright, we're in the rough, but I think we can use the iron from here, so that's not too bad. I wasn't really sure where else we'd go though, like, we could have hit the TNT. I don't think we can make it across there. But we really need that actually. Actually, we could use, um, we can use U-turn. In flight, activate with the right click, aim U-turn, fire, right click again. Alright, let's try and see if we can get this to work. I haven't used this one yet, so... Alright, so we go down here. Oh! I was too slow! I was like, uh, I was trying to figure out what it was. So close. Alright, well. 
I might have to use a couple of cards, unfortunately, to uh, get us to our next statue. Because we only have one left. Zoom cursed. Oh no. We're super zoomed as well, but luckily our bird's eye allows us to unzoom. We need a couple shots to get to the silver one. I don't even know if we'll have enough shots to make it here. Right, well, I'm gonna have to use. I'm gonna have to use this. Um. Well, that gives us two shots at least. Wait, zoom out. Ah, uh, stop it. Uh, use the driver, I guess, and we'll go long. I can't see shit because of the zoomed in curse. That's an awful one. Okay. Oh no. Oh, it might actually not be that bad. If I can do that exact same shot again. Can I though? I don't actually remember the angle. I don't think that's it. No! Oh. We are so screwed. Final shot. Um, I think... No, stop. We do have another one though, don't we? We have a couple of plus ones. Alright. Good. Good. Not good. Oh man, it was so close. What sort of angle do I, did I have last time? I got some not. <laughs> How did I do it the first time, man? Upside down cursed. Upside down? Oh, f f flip. Um, man, we are so screwed. Alright, well. <laughs> YOLO. Please go down the hole. Oh, man, this is awful. Well, we got in there, though. That was not... Oh, it's kind of helpful. The hole's right there. I can almost make it. Oh, uh, but now we're upside down. Ah, oh, man. The iron. What sort of shot is this going to be? I mean, that angle, it could almost go in. I mean, do I have any more... I don't have any more plus ones. We can take a practice shot, though. I'm going to take a practice shot. And then I'll see if I can uh, perhaps get this in. Alright, so that would have bounced over. Uh, <laughs> take one more. Because uh, we only have one shot, so it's in a really tricky situation here. Maybe just this one. Nope. Oh man, I don't have any more practice shots. Far out. I mean, like, I feel like the rocket ball would be good, but, like, I'm actually scared of using it in this situation. Alright. I think I can do it, guys. I think we can do it. I think so. I think just like there, maybe... No, it would need to be just a smidge more. Rip. GG. <laughs> no! This was a rough level. Um... And then I think, perhaps then you have to restart from hole one again, I think. Let's find out though. Honestly, it was not a bad effort. I feel like I could have done better, for sure. For sure. We are cursed to golf for the rest of our lives. If we fail to survive a hole at any one point, we return here. Okay. Okay, Scotsman. Ooh, there's something to do with a cheeky devil called the Greenskeeper. He can bend golf purgatory to his will. Nice. Soon it'll be you who bends golf purgatory to your will. Yeah, so the course is going to change every time as well. That's really cool though, so 
each time, yeah, it's going to change. I like it. I love the roguelike elements to this golf game. It's really cool. Really cool style as well. Alright guys, anyway, thank you for checking out Cursed to Golf. 